Hello and welcome to the PC Mission and Tech Help Show. I'm your host, Craig Chamberlain, and in the Faster 7 series today, I'm going to show you how to disable some unused Windows 7 features. Now, these features will always be running in the background because Windows really loves to do that. So it's good just to go through the list, see if you need it, see if you don't, and uh, remove the things you don't need. And then uh, that'll at least free up some resources for you. So let's go down to our Start button, like we have in just about every other video in this entire series. And we're going to select the Control Panel this time. And on the right hand side, it's going to list pro under programs the uninstall of program. Go ahead and select that. Now, when your uninstall comes up here, we have a nice little administrator shield here for the turn Windows features on or off. Go ahead and select that. Now, the Windows features list is going to be populated. It might take 30 seconds or so. And once it's completely populated, you can go down the list and you can enable or disable features you think you might not need. Now, for those of you who are unsure about certain services, then you probably don't want to uninstall them unless you Google them and find out exactly what they do. You can do the check mark next to it and see what they actually are as well. So let's say you never use the Windows DVD Maker. You might as well just remove that or the Windows Media Center or the Media Player. And you also have the option for all your games that are installed on the computer. If you don't do any kind of printing or documenting services, you can disable those. And then you can scroll down through the list and go ahead and uninstall a lot of them that you don't need. Now, another feature here is they have these XPS services. XPS is a document viewer and a document creator uh, service that's built into Windows 7. You can disable the service for printing. I didn't disable the service for viewer because I don't really know what Windows uses to view those files, so I didn't want to mess with it. But you can go ahead and disable the services if you don't print to XPS specifically. And this is just an example of some of the services you might not need. Again, if you're unsure, either don't uncheck it or uh, search it for it on Google and then uncheck it. When you're completely done, just select OK and Windows will run through the entire configurator for you. It'll remove all those features. It might prompt you to restart. Go ahead and restart your computer. It might have a adjusting Windows updates when you turn your computer back on. And after it's gone through all those, all of those features will be uninstalled. Now that's all there is to this video. As always, thanks for stopping by. Don't forget to leave comments and ratings, and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions, go ahead and swing by the website and the forum, and I'll do my best to get them answered for you. Thanks again.